Welcome mm -hmm. back. You hear that? I know that's six song. seasons, just hearing that song meant one thing. Viewers were heading into the seedy underworld of The Sopranos. Oh, indeed they are. And now. A new film. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, our we have this. Rob threw it down, but we have it memorized. No, take it away. <laughs> the Many Saints of Newark is coming out. It stars John Bernthal and Michael Gandolfini. Oh. Let's take a look at a clip, shall Good we? Good idea. Take them. I don't want any part of this. None of it. I don't want any part of this. Ah, what this? What this? <laughs> what this? Michael what's and this? John, welcome, what welcome. Yeah. <laughs> okay, this is so exciting. Savannah and I were just saying a lot of people would like to be sitting in our shoes right now talking uh -oh. to you guys. Now, Michael, is it true initially you were thinking to yourself, you know what, I don't know that I want to audition for that. I don't want to do that. Yeah, when uh, the audition first came around, it, you know, I had never seen the show. I had never really in any involvement, so I, I didn't even really know what Tony Soprano was. Can we pause for a second? You never saw the show? No. He was little. It's I'm, not for yeah. kids, right? But even as yeah. you were growing, you didn't want to see it, huh? No, I just yeah. felt... It's going to be an intense experience when yeah. I do it, and I couldn't really convince myself a reason to do it yet until I got this amazing opportunity in this movie, and then I got to sort of become a fan like everyone else. Like, we, You know, Michael, you're so uh, stunning in, in the movie, mm -hmm. and you're so self-possessed, but let's just pause for a moment and look at what you've done here. Not only is it your first movie, yep. yeah. that first movie is a prequel to an iconic, beloved, yes. legendary show. Yeah. You're playing an iconic character, mm -hmm. and that character happens to be your yeah. father. <laughs> yeah. You got guts. Oh, yeah. How did, I mean, honestly, like, what did it mm -hmm. take inside you to take on mm -hmm. a challenge like that? Because it takes bravery. Sure. Um, uh, the, well, I just felt like I sort of broke it down to these little chunks. I didn't think about the macro. Mm. Um, it was first about uh, doing a good audition, doing a second audition, doing a third audition. They really made you go <laughs> through all those? Yeah, yeah, three auditions. And then, um, you know, just like... Auditioning was the hardest part because you don't have anyone to lean on. Once, like, John came on and I, I, like, leaned on these guys so much, it was much better. It was just about being the best actor that I could be and learning from these guys and sort of, like, just doing my job the best I could. That's what I was focused on every day, not anything else. And, John, did you become a little bit of a teacher? Again, this is his very first role, trying to learn how listen, to do it. Listen, I, I, I have uh, so much love for this young man. Yeah. I, I, I go from being so uh, proud of him to, oh. to in awe of him. Uh, he, he, he approached this with so much courage. I mean, you guys said it, and conviction. And yeah. uh, he's like, he, he, like I love him. And I, the, <laughs> my job on this film was to be there by him, by his side, getting his back. And there, there's, there's no one. There's no. It's just that this is. Uh, it's, it's. It was a beautiful thing to sort of be part of his process. And that's, that's. Uh, I'll always be grateful. It for also that. took courage for you too, because anyone who tries to um, mess with something that is so iconic. All eyes are on you. How much pressure did you feel as well? Listen, it's it's um, y you know it's single handedly the greatest yeah. sort of piece of art of uh, you know in, in, in that that's been in the zeitgeist in the modern zeitgeist. And so I think you know you can't really think about it in those terms. I'm I, I, honestly for me, first person I met on this job was Mikey. He came up to my house in Ojai, California. He told me the mission that he was on and what he was trying to do. And for me, it was really just being there with him and for him and, and, and by his side. And that was something that was really, uh, I, again, I cannot say enough about oh. this young man, how great an actor he is and how great a human being he is. So, I, I, you know, I believe it's Well, true. you guys are, I know, it's clear you have a bond because you're yeah. actually wearing a matching outfit almost today. <laughs> when we put you on the two shot there, it does look like twins. His socks are way better. Mike, you got to show He does socks. have, he does. I mean, his socks, man. Sock, sock game yeah. is so strong. Yeah. You know, I mean, Michael, for you, it's, it's, it's for someone who lost their father mm -hmm. so young, mm -hmm. I, and I can relate to this, mm -hmm. you're looking, anything that connects you to him is like a, it's a treasure, it's a gift. Yeah. Is there something healing about kind of like stepping I, I your father was not Tony Soprano that's totally. not who he was yeah. but something he invested so much in and gave to for you yeah. to kind of hold hands with that you, you know I I when we were doing it I never thought about it it was just doing the best job but when I sat in that theater and I watched mm -hmm. it for the first time I felt like 
oh man, I, I, I got to do this with my dad. We mm -hmm. got to do this thing together. Um, and it was a really incredible feeling and, and shocked me just because I, I think I, I numbed that out because I just wanted to be a good actor and do my mm -hmm. job and learn. But I did feel that um, when, I, when I watched it for the first time. His uh, 60th birthday just passed. Mm -hmm. I wondered what you were thinking about on that day. <clears throat> Um, it's been so long that it felt like a good day. Um, yeah. you know, uh, any, any anniversary is a celebration of him, I think, like, and just the, the gratitude and, you know, all the lessons he taught me and all the people in my life that have stepped up and helped me. And so it, it felt like a, uh, a celebration of him. Well, I love, uh, you had never seen The Sopranos, but John, you were the opposite. Yeah. You wanted to be on The Sopranos <laughs> so it. bad in the so original. Bad. I heard you were like willing to be like the the, the dead body victim. Man, like I, you were I like followed any the role. yellow signs. I just I, I hung out on the set. You know anything? Can I walk in the background? Yeah, never got that audition, but yeah. Well, see, dreams come true they do. for and both they of do. you. Did you really have to just real quick? Did you really have to slap Michael for real? Oh yeah. Was there oh, a real slap? Oh, hundred. But he's Wait, super yeah. game. No, he's like he no baby deal? boy. Yeah, he's yeah. A, he's about this thing. You had a slapping scene. Well, yeah. I mean, we had. I, I, Alessandra slaps me twice, yeah. and then he slaps me. I, mine wasn't written. I, I think I was yeah. like, yeah, I think it would be funny if I hit you, too. Yeah. You know what I mean? but, yeah. but John definitely, he was like, look how good I am at, like, not hurting you. Like, I can, like, I'm so, because of, you know. I'm but did it kind of hurt so, a, little? a little? bit. I mean, it felt, you know, it's, when well, you're yeah, there, you, yeah, 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 it's yeah, good. Yeah, yeah, it's good. You're it. still hitting my face. Yeah, it was good. And they cut that scene. I know, after I all know. that. Yeah, uh, it's one of my favorite scenes still. Well, you'll always have that Slapping scene. There you go. Yeah. Pleasure, Michael you John, thank you so much. Thank Congratulations you to both of you. Yeah. The Many Saints of Newark <laughs> hits theaters and HBO Max next Friday, October 1st. We don't have to encourage people to check it out. You know everyone's going to be Congrats, wanting to see guys. It. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.